The parents of a Cobb County teen have filed one of the first cyber bullying lawsuits in Georgia. It comes after classmates allegedly created a fake Facebook page under the girl's name and posted graphic and lewd messages. Fox News Justin Gray is here with that story for us tonight. Justin. Tom, the cyber bullies sent friend requests to the teen's family, classmates, and even teachers, then pretended to be her as they posted racially suggestive and sexually offensive messages. After having no luck getting the page taken down through the school and police, the parents have now sued the bullies. To me, it was upsetting, like how my friends would just turn on me like that. 14 year old Alex Boston didn't understand what was happening when she went to school and discovered a fake Facebook page with her name, but a picture altered to make her look fat and a string of racially offensive and sexually explicit posts too graphic for us to show on TV. It was vulgar, nasty, just mean and uh, it it shocked us. As soon as I got to school, I was all dressed up and happy, and then all of my friends started saying, why'd you say this to me on Facebook? Why'd you say this? When Alex came home and showed her parents, they reported the cyberbullying to school officials and police, but there was little anyone could do. 11 states have a cyberbullying law, but Georgia does not. When we were kids, bullying stayed on the playground. Now it follows you 24-7. We want to protect our child, and we want to protect other children. So Alex's parents have filed one of the first cyber bullying lawsuits in the state of Georgia. They're suing the kids they believe are behind the fake page and their parents. To untie the hands of the educators and the police in these kinds of situations so that the law in Georgia is able to address these situations. I just don't want it to happen to anybody else because it feels bad. This week, after nearly a year of emails and complaints, Facebook finally took down the fake page. Alex's parents say they want to go forward with this lawsuit to bring attention to what they say is a hole in the Georgia law allowing these sorts of attacks, Tom. All right, Justin, thank you. The